All right, hey, Omega here. I got a little, uh, another show and tell, and these are uh, these are three uh, Overev uh, scene dioramas that I bought uh, on Amazon a while back. They were selling like a set of all three of them. I don't know if there's more of them than this, but uh, Overev is a is a manga. It's kind of like Initial D sorta if with uh, with girls, and uh, it's uh, the author is uh, Katsumi Yamaguchi. And um, and I really liked his work. Um, uh, and uh, I I really wish they had brought this uh, this turned this manga into anime, but it never did. There were rumors that it would have happened, but uh, um, yeah. So this was around the initial D era when initial D first came out, and uh, I actually, actually, um, I myself uh, I was the I was part of, on the translation team for the manga. We were translating it for uh, into English from Japanese, and then uh, and then like it moved through the, a couple different uh, manga translation teams, and and then I became the head of the team, and then eventually uh, I I just stopped. And I think till this day there's still there's still a team doing uh still doing some of them. So thanks for whoever picked up the work that I did. Um, I myself cannot translate Japanese, but. Um, but I got a team together and I edit and do and distributed a good chunk of it. So I brought over to the United States. So anyway, so these are some scene dioramas. I don't think they sold they sell these anymore. These are like some of my overrub treasures. Sometimes I I go on eBay and stuff and I I just look for overrev stuff. Sometimes I find it. You know, it's uh, it's a very old manga. So. Uh, they don't sell stuff for it anymore, unfortunately. So today, I have never unboxed these. So, and this will be just a quick one, um, just to show you what it looks like. But anyway, I have the boxes all like this, lined up like this, because all the boxes are the same. But they have different uh, scenes. So, so this is the back. This is what the side looks like. Uh, the other side has Ryoko on it. There you go. So the, actually, all the sides are different. So this is a, I think this is a scene from, oh, I don't remember, an Integra? I don't remember an Integra in, in the Overev. Um, yeah, so I don't know. I don't remember what, this is probably one of the, um, one of the, the back covers of one of the mangas. But this is Ryoko, she's the main character. And then this is, uh, this is uh, Sawako. And, oh my god, I forgot. I think her name is Aika. She's she drives the Honda Civic. Uh, you may see it. You may actually see it in some of these uh, dioramas. So these are actually uh, these dioramas have been um, they're like recreations of scenes in the manga, which is pretty cool. Like I remember all of these scenes. So so those are the sides. They're all the same. Like I said, the top has as a scene from when the uh, when. Um, the MR2, the AW11 is uh, is battling the S13 Sylvia. I think it's a super stock Sylvia or something. That's what they called it. Um, yeah. So and then there's the bottom. See, it's made in China by a company named Scratch Company. And uh, yeah. So there it is. So I'm gonna go open it up for you guys. Finally, I'm gonna finally open it because I figured like. It's probably not best to to um, display them in the boxes because you can kind of not. They were they were made to be displayed not in the boxes, so I'm gonna go. I'm finally gonna take them out. Um, these have survived like a house fire. Oh no, not a house fire. I think uh, I think some water got a leaky roof got on this. That's why this one's wet. This one has water spots on it. So there it is. Comes in the box. So like I said, I don't know where you can buy these anymore. There it is. I wonder if you can open it. Uh, nope, nope. It must be glued or something, so you can't take them out. And what, uh, actually, so this is, uh, uh I, I don't remember. So this is the S14. Yeah, so this is Sawako's S14 and the, uh, and the AW11 on like a pier or something. I don't I actually don't remember that scene, uh, but you can see the AW11 looks a lot like uh, I used to have a little keychain AW11, and it looks exactly the same thing. So I'll try to get some better pictures of these later with better lighting. 
There it is. There's the AW11 with the um, with the S14 at the pier. And I'm gonna go ahead and open up the other ones. Okay, so there's diorama number two. This is a. Uh, so, I don't know, I guess I kind of lied when I said they were scenes from the manga. I don't actually don't remember this one either. Um, so, I mean, it probably there probably was a scene very similar to this in the manga, but it wasn't very memorable. This is uh, the AW11 and the S14 driving on Toge. It's very nice. They have, uh, there's little, uh, there's little background, so you can see that. You can see the overrev here. It says overrev. There's like a little guardrail, sort of. And then there's a picture of the toge in the background and the guardrails and stuff. It's very cool. I like it. I like it a lot. And I think you can stack them. Yes, you can stack them. Nice. They don't stack very well, though. Okay, so this is actual. This is a, another diorama. This is a. This is the EG6 Honda Civic and the AW11. At a Ako Ako as a garage. This is the place where she works at. And you can see, like, peeking in the background is like, that's actually the cover for one of the mangas. Um, yeah, it is. <laughs> it is one of the covers for the manga. So the AW11 in the front. So you can see a bunch of little tools on the floor there, all over the place. Uh, reminds me of uh, Sometimes when I work, it's on the car. Okay, it's like so that. yeah, here you can see the AW11 again with the AG6 on the lift, uh, and then some batteries, some tools on the ground. Looks like an air compressor hose or a welder. It's a welding mask. There's some wheels in the back there. The wheels are not to scale. <laughs> That's a funny thing because the wheels are much bigger than the car. So there you go. I hope you've enjoyed my little uh, show and tell. There it is. This one has the overhead logo on it too. Inside of the garage. There's a little clock there. And then, uh, and then there's like a garage door. It's inside a garage. Very cool. Alright. Hades and McGowan.